Hey guys, today I'll be showing you how to boot your Switch into RCM mode. This is something that was recently discovered and released to the public, and allows us to load things such as Linux, the Homebrew Launcher, and potentially a lot of other stuff in the future. So this takes advantage of a hardware flaw in the Switch by shorting out two pins on the Joy-Con rail on the right side of the Switch. So to do this, you need something like a paperclip or a 3D printed thing as you can see on screen now, and you just need to be able to connect two pins on the right side of the Switch. I'll be showing you how to do that too later in the video. So then on top of that, you also need a USB-C to USB-A cable. So pretty much something to plug your Switch into your PC via a USB port. And obviously you need a Switch. So once you've got all that done, then we are all good and I can show you how to set it up now. So to start off, you want to remove the Joy-Cons from your Switch if they're not already detached. Next, you want to take your paperclip or 3D printed jig thing and slide it into the right side like I'm doing now. You won't be able to tell if you got it in the right position until later in the video, so you can just hope for now and we'll see later. If you're using a 3D printed thing like I am, then the chances of it being successful are a lot higher than that if you were to use a paperclip or a wire or something like that. So next, you need to plug the USB-C side of the cable into your switch and the USB-A side into your PC, like I'm doing now. Next, you need to make sure that your switch is powered completely off and not just in sleep mode. This will not work if you do not power off your switch completely first. So now, while you have the thing in the right side of your switch, you have the USB-C cable in your switch and the USB-A side of it in your PC, and it's all turned off, then you can continue by holding down the volume up button and then pressing the power button once. You should not see anything show up on your switch screen, it should remain black. If it turns on normally, then you probably did not connect the pins properly, and I would recommend readjusting them and trying this again. But if it seems to be working correctly, then you can verify this on your PC by seeing if a device called APX appears to be plugged in. It might say installing device driver in the bottom right side of your PC screen, or you may have to go to device manager to be able to see it like I'm in right now. But yeah, if you see this, then that means your Switch is successfully booted into RCM mode and you can use any of the stuff that people have made that utilizes this mode. So yeah, that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching, leave a like if this video helped you, comment if you need help or if you want to help anyone else out, and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. And I'll see you next time.